Hello dear students and welcome to a new week. This is a summary for week five and the lesson that we are going to cover in this week. So happy new week. We will start with lesson uh, 2.4 which is about use the strategies to add decimals. In this lesson you will be able to add decimals to the hundreds using partial sums. You will add decimals to hundreds using partial sums and you will follow some steps to add decimals. This is the, our uh, key concept and this is a summary for the steps that we are going to use to add decimals. First of all, it's very important to line up the decimal points on top of each other and in the answer too. The second thing that you have to track on zeros. In the empty places, you have to put zeros. This step is really important to line up the digits. The third step is to drop down the decimal point, then add normally as you would do with whole numbers. The second lesson that we're going to learn about use strategies to subtract decimals. In this lesson, you'll be able to subtract decimals to the hundreds using partial differences. You will learn how to subtract decimals to hundreds using familiar strategies such as, such as partial differences and you will be able to follow some steps to subtract decimals. This is our uh, summary and this is our key concept. Line up the decimal points. It's very important to line up the decimal points on top of each other. The second thing you have to track on zeros. Don't forget to put zeros. It's very important when you want to regroup. Then you drop down the decimal point in the same place. Don't change its place. Then subtract normally as you would do with whole numbers. And also, we are going to learn how to solve word problems that have decimals, uh, subtraction, and addition. And we will be using the cubes strategy to solve these word problems. So have a lovely week. See you in the next video.